Right, so uh, Peter Barron, um, you're in the Coastal Premier League uh, yes. as of next year, which is uh, great news for uh, Bellingen FC. Why did you want to be in the CPL? We've got uh, a very competitive senior team, two senior teams, and over the years that they've just found that the opposition hasn't been um, pushing them hard enough. Um, and so our club captain, Harry uh, Henry Gale, he's really pushed, let's get into this Coastal Premier League. Um, and it's just really exciting because we know that the teams that we're going to be um, up against are a lot more competitive. They'll really push us. Um, and I think it's just going to be best for the whole club. Okay. And, and Peter, tell us about the culture of your club. <coughs> Bellingen um, is a, a, a very much a family club. Um, there's, uh, I was just talking earlier that you know, you've got these senior players who are really happy to mentor these younger players. And I think that permeates down through all the teams. Um, we've got parents who are very happy to get involved. Um, this year has been our biggest year ever. Um, we, so we've, we're actually gathering more players um, as, the, as we just become more successful. And I think that's just generating a really lovely vibe, real family, hey, if you want to have a go, we're happy for you to be involved. But also, you know, if you're competitive, then we'll take on um, and probably um, help you help you reach your potential. And uh, you spoke about the family club and all of that. When there's a match here next year, what sort of uh, atmosphere can we expect down here at Connell Park? Look, I think it's just going to get bigger. Um, when we do have our home games, um, even though that like there's nothing else happening in at Connell Park, I would say we'd be probably regularly getting about 300 people. And I think with the Coastal Premier League that the, the people will be coming out going, hey, it's going to be a lot more competitive game. We're seeing some really good players from, from Port Macquarie all the way up to um, Grafton Way. So, um, yeah, I think the crowds are just going to get bigger. And, um, you know, Bellingen has, um, we've got a fairly loud crowd, which is really good. Um, and I think that the players will get excited about that too, having that at home ground advantage. And so what happens now between you know, being you know, invited to join the competition yep. and kick off in uh, March next year? So we've actually, um, part of the application when um, Henry and um, Matt uh, Jaff was putting in the application, we actually said as a committee, that, look, this is really big. So you guys are going to have to come up with a number of uh, support um, leaders, committee, um, and so between now and kickoff next year, we're really going to get that subcommittee working. Um, so they actually take on the role of the CPL liaison officers for the club, um, because it's already busy as it is, as I said, you know, having huge numbers. Um, so we're really going to have that little subgroup running the, the show, doing both the promotion, getting more players in. We're looking to um, finalise um, some uh, really good coaches. Um, for both the first grade and uh, the reserve grade. Um, and I think once that's announced, that'll even attract more um, really good players. Congratulations. We look forward to seeing you on the field next year. Can't wait. Looking forward to it.